Are you weakening your bones at night without realizing it? Welcome to Dr. Mercola's Cellular Wisdom. Stay informed with quick, easy to listen summaries of our latest articles, perfect for when you're on the go. No reading required. Subscribe for free at Mercola.com for the latest health insights. Hello, and welcome to Dr. Mercola's Cellular Wisdom. I'm Ethan Foster, and today we're unpacking how your circadian rhythm quietly governs bone breakdown and repair, and why disrupted sleep, shift work, and evening light can accelerate bone loss even when you eat well and exercise. I'm Alara Skye. Your circadian rhythm is your 24-hour timing system. It coordinates when you feel alert or sleepy, but it also sets the schedule for bone remodeling. When this clock is in sync, you renew bone efficiently. When it's off, resorption races ahead of rebuilding and your skeleton becomes more fragile over time. Researchers from the University of Surrey and the University of Sheffield drew blood from healthy adults every two hours across 26 hours after a week of fixed sleep and morning outdoor light. They measured SPINP, a marker of bone formation, and SCTX, a marker of bone resorption, to see how these processes behave across the day. They found a clear rhythm in resorption, but not in formation. SCTX rose and fell on a circadian schedule, indicating osteoclast activity is clock-controlled, while SPINP stayed comparatively steady. That means timing matters. If your internal clock is misaligned, you're more likely to experience resorption spikes at the wrong time, tipping the balance toward bone loss. This has practical implications. Chronic sleep restriction, late-night light exposure, and night shift patterns are linked to faster bone thinning. It also points toward chronotherapy, the idea that taking bone supportive interventions when resorption naturally peaks may improve impact. If breakdown rises at night, pre-bed strategies that target resorption could be better timed than morning use. The study did focus on younger adults with lower osteoporosis risk, so the next step is confirming patterns in older people and those already facing bone loss. Even so, Establishing a circadian signature for resorption reframes, prevention and treatment around restoring proper timing rather than chasing nutrients alone. Zooming into the cell, a biomedicines analysis explains how your clock talks to bone proteins through post-translational modifications. Small chemical switches such as phosphorylation and acetylation. These switches determine whether proteins that drive bone building or breakdown activate, rest, or degrade on a daily schedule. When your rhythm is disrupted by inconsistent sleep or round-the-clock light, those switches get stuck. Proteins tied to new bone formation, including Runix-2 and osteocalcin, lose their timing cues. Two core clock proteins, BMAL1 and CLOCK, normally keep a feedback loop humming. When that loop falters, remodeling falls out of sync and repair slows. Melatonin sits at the center of restoring this timing. A review in Frontiers in Cell and Developmental Biology shows melatonin aligns nightly repair signals, improves bone density and microstructure, and reduces oxidative stress. It regulates parathyroid hormone and calcium balance, supports glutathione, and lowers melondialdehyde, a marker of oxidative damage that accelerates bone aging. Mechanistically, melatonin suppresses NF-kappa B and ERK 1-2 pathways that push osteoclasts to multiply, while increasing osteoprotogerin and reducing rankle to prevent excessive resorption. Human data are encouraging. In a year-long trial with postmenopausal women, a combination of melatonin, vitamin D3, vitamin K2, and strontium, MSDK, increased spinal bone density by 4.3% and hip density by 2.2% versus placebo, alongside improved mood and sleep. Benefits appear strongest when melatonin levels match their natural nighttime peak. Most of your melatonin is produced inside mitochondria, and that production depends on natural sunlight exposure. Morning light helps set the clock that governs nightly melatonin release, linking daylight habits to after-dark bone renewal. Aligning your day with light and darkness turns those cellular switches back to their intended positions. If you want actionable steps to protect your bones by repairing timing, start when you wake. Get outside within 30 minutes and aim for 10 to 15 minutes of direct morning sunlight without glasses. 
This helps reset your clock daily so nighttime melatonin can rise on schedule and resorption can quiet at the appropriate time. Keep a consistent sleep-wake schedule. Go to bed and get up at roughly the same times, including weekends. Predictable sleep restores coordination between osteoclasts and osteoblasts. So breakdown and formation return to balance. If nights run late, move bedtime earlier in 15-minute steps until it fits a natural rhythm. Dim artificial light two hours before bed. Blue rich light from LEDs and screens suppresses melatonin and keeps repair on hold. Lower household lighting after sunset and enable night modes if you must use devices. If evening training is part of your routine, finish workouts at least two hours before bedtime to avoid delaying your melatonin rise. Eat and move in rhythm with the day. Make your largest meals during daylight and finish dinner at least three hours before bed. Daytime movement, walking, stretching, or light resistance work provides the mechanical input bones need to stay strong while keeping your metabolic and circadian signals aligned. Mindfulness practices support the same alignment. Techniques such as meditation or yoga help steady your stress response, which interacts with your circadian system. When stress cues ease, the timing loop that coordinates bone turnover stabilizes more easily. As you apply these steps, remember the broader theme. Your skeleton runs on time. Nutrients matter, but without synchronized rhythms, you're pushing against biology's schedule. By restoring morning light exposure, regular sleep, darker evenings, daytime meals and movement, and stress regulation, you support the molecular mechanisms that keep your bones resilient. Here's your challenge. Over the next seven days, step outside within 30 minutes of waking for at least 10 minutes, dim your lights two hours before bed, and finish dinner three hours before sleep. If you're evaluating supplements with your clinician, discuss whether an evening strategy and, where appropriate, the MSDK combination align with your needs. Thank you for watching Dr. Mercola's Cellular Wisdom. We'll see you on the next episode. Thanks for watching. Subscribe now and click the notification bell so you never miss an update. See you in the next video.